Alrighty, you guys. So today is going to be focusing on the sword. I'm really trying to push it and get it done. I've got to do some grinding on the blade, and that's really all I can do at home right now. I need a drill press. So once I get that, then I'll be able to finish the handle and the pommel and the guard. So those will be the next pieces after the grinding's done. I go into work today at noon, so it's a little bit odd. I'm not sure how the vlog's going to turn out because of that, because that's kind of a random interruption in my day. But hey, what are you going to do, right? Uh, let's get inside and get to work. All right, so we've got the sword all clamped up right here. It's not going to move around too much. It'll move around a little bit. But now comes the fun part of just taking a file and It's extremely boring. This is the second worst part behind sanding. Alrighty. So there we go, this is the side I've been working on. The beveling and the fuller in there. I got really close there, I apologize. So it's time for lunch and to shower and get ready for work. Let's do this. That's like my go-to when I leave is let's do this. This house smells like bacon. Why does this house smell like bacon? Is there bacon? There is no bacon. My parents ate all the bacon. I knew they didn't really love me. Running through my checklist, phone, keys, wallet. We're good. So like I said, I gotta go in at noon today. Hold on a second. There we go. It was way too bright. But I go in at noon today instead of my normal 5.30. So it kind of throws a wrench into the vlogging. I'm not really sure what today's gonna look like now. But, if you guys have any questions about the knife making or sword making process, let me know in the comments and I'll try to get to those. Um, try to answer as many questions as I can, as many as I know the answer to, even though you know, I'm not a necessarily great blacksmith or knife maker. I'll do my best. Got to run and it's 11.30 right now and I want to get lunch over at Culver's. They got my order right last time, which was nice. So, I'm gonna try to get up there, see how crowded it is. If it's not too crowded. <laughs> I'll get Culver's. Oh, I made it. I made it and I've got plenty of time. And I got my food. So, I don't have extra hands to carry my food and you guys. So I'm making a choice and I'm going with food. See you guys when I get off work. Oh. Hey there. Whew. Six o'clock, I am off work. I wanna go home, go to bed, wake up, and watch a little bit play football. But I can't, I got to adult. I turned the radio off too. Yeah. Seatbelt on because I adult vlog off because I adult. This is the second time that I have lost my keys only to realize they are in my pocket. <sighs> well, we're back home and I've got a cool package that I cannot wait to get inside and open up with you guys. Oh boy. Come on, come on. Woo! Woo! And dark. Light dark. I can throw this package around if I want to. So I'm gonna go grab a knife and we are gonna get into it. So 
hear it. Let's get right into this thing. Eh. All right. For those of you noticing, yes, this is the F3 that I've been making. It is 100% done and ready. Oh, sweet baby. Oh, yeah. I had never really heard of these guys. I found them on Kickstarter, and I was one of the backers there. These are gonna be uh, high impact lining for fit and cushion. Not exactly sure how they work or how they fit in there, but you know they're extremely thin, so. But we'll find out. Obviously one for each foot. And then, oh yeah. I like that. It's a good looking shoe right there. So inside we've got a high density insole for durable cushion. This one is for fit and cushioning. So you might put this one on top of the other one. Yeah, you put this one underneath actually, the one that's currently in here, that one in there. Got a really nice looking sole on there. Got to feel like, feels like it's got a good grip. I am very excited to get out to the next Ninja Warrior competition that I can make it to and give these puppies a try. Cause I have high hopes for these. I'm really excited about them actually. So thank you to the Olo guys. This once more is not a sponsored video. I'm not sponsored by them. Um, I just happen to really like the way this product looks and I happen to be really excited about it. It's not really an overstatement when I say that I lose my keys about five times a day. I want you guys to see where I lost them this time. Right there. I left them in the door. What is wrong with me? All right, so I got my subway, which means I am set for the night. But that also means that I am ending this vlog. I know it's sad, but Louisville, University of Louisville is playing football against Clemson. I can't miss this. So, I am fond of your faces, you guys. Like, comment, subscribe, you know what to do. Give it a share if you feel like it. I'll see you.